Right hander against the right hander. The outfield is straight up and deep on Fielder. He is the DH today. Swing. There's a drive to left. That one is long gone. Fielder weighs into that first pitch with his 29th home run of the year. The Tigers have just finished their 2002 season. And I've just finished my baseball broadcasting career. And it's time to say goodbye, but I think uh, goodbyes are sad, and I'd much rather say hello. Hello to a new adventure. I'm not leaving, folks. I'll still be with you, living my life in Michigan, my home state, surrounded by family and friends. And rather than goodbye, please allow me to say thank you. Thank you for letting me be part of your family. Thank you for taking me with you to that cottage up north, to the beach, the picnic, your workplace, and your backyard. Thank you for sneaking your transistor under the pillow as you grew up loving the Tigers. Now, I might have been a small part of your life, but you've been a very large part of mine, and it's my privilege and honor to share with you the greatest game of all. Now, God has a new adventure for me, and I'm ready to move on. So I leave you with a deep sense of appreciation for your long-time loyalty and support. I thank you very much, and God bless all of you. Wow. I don't know why. <clears throat> I've heard lots of Ernie Harwell, but that just kind of took me back. You know what I mean? I wanted to put my head down in the pillow like when I was in probably fifth grade. Did you do that? And with had the radio? the radio, yeah, the, the AM uh, radio next to the bed. And uh, I never was awake from the end of the games usually. But I, you know, I was lulled to sleep by that voice. See, my dad did the same thing. And when he heard that farewell speech, when Ernie did that, he, he, it really got him because he did exactly that. Yeah. And I've heard so many people that did that. Yeah. And uh, sometimes I would wake up, uh, you know, and the, and the radio would still be going, the game be over. I don't know who won. But uh, Jay Roberts' Night Flight show would be on. And I'd hear this very creative program. On the, and he would uh, play songs, and he would pretend he was flying an airplane. And it was all theater of their mind kind of stuff but right there when you started playing that i could I, I wanted to put my head down on the pillow and just slip away and zone off into the into the night ernie harwell that's really cool what a classy goodbye too I, i'd heard you know you hear a lot of these broadcasting goodbyes that one that one to me just about takes the cake maybe that one and johnny carson two fine examples 15 after the hour, Michael Patrick Shields, radio stations across the state of Michigan. 